Well, a lot can happen to a person in a decade. That's for sure. A new documentary follows a group of youngsters who all performed together at Verona Area Community Theater. The filmmakers went back to revisit them 10 years later to see what they gained from the experience. Take a look. have to keep going and hope that the audience doesn't notice too much. It definitely helped me boost my confidence and just overall um, presence in public settings. But I also think it really helped me build just my teamwork abilities and being able to put something together with a group of people and collaborating with so many people from a super young age. The documentary stage presence was produced by Greg Jeske and H J Dog Productions. Greg, welcome back to Live Before. Hi, good Greg, to see good you again. to see you. you guys, thanks for having me on. How did this all come about? You know, it came about, uh, it kind of fell into my lap. Uh, I got a phone call uh, about a year ago um, from a woman who said she had a bunch of old footage of kids doing a play. Uh, could I do something with it? And I said, well, uh, l let me look at some of it. Well, I started to look at it and realized there was a lot of it and realized that I had an idea for what to do here. Let's go talk to these kids again 10 years later now 10 to 20 you know that that that, that that's, a, that's a chunk of time where you go from being a kid to a young adult mm -hmm. and and so i thought it'd be interesting to hear what they remembered you know what stuck with them and some of the lessons they might have learned along the so way so they were 10 years old when they were first shot 10 to 12 depending on uh, on the kid yeah so, okay so well, that, young adults. Is, that yeah. is fascinating i mean first of all what a gift for them and their parents to have that you know to see how they transition over those 10 years but what is it about theater? There is something about theater that connects all of these kids. What did they get out of the experience? You know, it's interesting. Uh, I, I, I saw a lot of similarities with sports as these uh, kids talked about what they remembered. Because a lot of what they remembered is working together. A lot of what they remembered was uh, sacrificing for the team as it were, uh, the group, uh, you know, the, the theater group in this case. Um, there, there was also a, a sense of inclusion that went along with this uh, because they had a, a young woman or a, a girl at the time um, who uh, was a person with a disability and they decided to make room for her. Um, and at the same time, there was also this broader mission of, of the adults who ran the children's theater there that this was about the best experience. So one thing they did was they didn't give the lead role year after year to the same kids because the same kids were the best. They spread the wealth, so to speak. Oh, I so I, I just thought there were some really neat messages there and, you know, stuff that we often forget these days. It seems to kind of fall through the cracks. Well, presence, as in gifts, stage presence. That's what these kids learned from this. Exactly. I, I was on a walk one day and I was thinking presence on stage because that's what they were being taught is to have a presence and it just kind of clicked. But the presence, the gifts they get from being up there is really what they were all talking about. Um, you know, what they, what they kept with them today. Great title. Ten years later, were they all still participating in theater? You know, to varying degrees, but um, in fact, one, Corinna, is actually majoring in it now. But they all uh, kind of found their own ways, but all also had sort of this connection, whether they planned to go to it again as young adults or at least kept up with it, you know, as, as fans. They were still interested in it, yeah. So where can folks see the film? Uh, jdogproductions.com is uh, where you will find the link to it and um, it's it's a free watch um, Terry Dvorak was very generous in deciding that uh, she wanted to have this made and let everybody see it now you're gonna okay. follow them 10 years from now <laughs> not a bad idea <laughs> no. yeah. especially if the ones are majoring in theaters yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. get all the way to Broadway, on Broadway. where's my notebook <laughs> yeah. Greg great to see you again nice to see you great to see you thanks so much